Oh, hi, Joby. Oh, hi. You're here. I'm Dr. Grancy. How are you? I'm good. How good. are you? I thought you had some Kids Corner to do today. Yeah, well, um, I was about to do one, but then all of a sudden, like, I felt like I, I can't just see. I can't see clearly. You can't see clearly. Well, come on. Yeah. Let's take a look. Let me come a little closer. Okay. All right. Let's see. Your glasses seem straight. I'm going to just do a little test. Okay. Mm -hmm. Which way is my finger pointing? I can't really see that. Okay, well, how about now? Can you see now? Mm, too smudged. Too smudged? All right, how about, do you see how many fingers I'm holding up? Looks like you're holding about four. No, two. I can see, Joby, you're having a little bit of a problem. Yeah. But let me see this for a minute. When I look into your eyes, yeah, they, they look okay. I don't really see a problem on the inside of your eyes. Maybe the problem is not on the inside of your eyes. Maybe. You know, Jovi, when we're not following Christ, sometimes our world looks like a horrible place. And sometimes we might tolerate or accept actions and words of other people. So maybe you're having some trouble with that. What do you think? Yeah, I just can't see clearly. So you're saying... <clears throat> You're saying that our attitudes and you can ideas... Look, you can look over there to see maybe you can... Oh, hi! Hi! Our attitudes and ideas are the eyeglasses through, our, through which we see our lives. If our glasses are smudged or dirty, our lives look dim. Hmm, that could be the problem. Can I be looking at these while you're talking to the people? Yeah. Okay. That kind of feels better, to be honest. If our attitudes are not well focused, the whole world appears distorted. To see clearly, we need to keep our attitudes and ideas clean. We have resentment, denial, self-pity, and unforgiveness. How do we do that? Well, we clean off our lenses. Let's see. We clean off our lenses because you're freeing your heart, right? Yeah. And of denial. On the one who can help us. And that one is Jesus. Well, Jovi, how do we focus on Jesus? Well, there's a few things that we do have to do. We read the Bible, we read devotions, we pray, and we talk to other Christians. Okay. Now, let's take a look through here. Does that seem a little clearer? Ooh, that looks way clearer. Thank so just you. talking about Jesus is helping. Yeah. But you know what, Jovi? Sometimes our lenses they're gonna fog up again. Yeah. Because it always happens. Life is not perfect. So when they fog up again, which they're going to, what do we do? We clean them. Clean them off again. And, and how do we focus, clean them off? And focus on the one who can help us. So that one is Jesus. And that one is Jesus. And it's kind of like seeing through the eyes of Jesus, right? Mm -hmm. Right? Okay, I'm gonna finish cleaning these off. And would you read our scripture for our friends today? Yeah, okay, so... Do you need these glasses? Oh, yeah, sure. To see clearly? I can see so much better. Okay, scripture. That's the, um, the name of it is Philippians... Philippians. Philippians 3, 15 through 16. So, so let's keep focused on that goal. Those of what those of us who want everything God has for us. And any of you have something else in my mind, something less than total, a total commitment, God will clear your blurred vision. You'll see it yet. Now that we're on the right track, let's stay on it. You know what? That scripture fits so good, I want you to read it again. Okay. Nice and loud, so everybody can hear it. Okay. Philippians 3, Philippians 15 and 16. 3? Yeah. So let's keep focused on that goal. Those of us who want everything God has for us, <laughs> if, any, if any of you have something else in mind, something less than total commitment, God will clear your blurred vision. You'll see it yet. Now that we're on the right track, let's stay on it. Okay, and I think you're on the right track. Yeah. Or don't you? Mm -hmm. I kind of think you always were, but we need to show people that might be off track 
because we all get off track every now and then, right? Mm -hmm. So we need to clean our glasses and vision, vision. right? Clean our, clear our vision. Yeah. All right. So let's pray that if anybody who's listening today might not be seeing clearly, that they will hear your message. Okay. Okay? All right. How will you pray? All right, I will. All right. Dear God, thank you for this lesson today about seeing clearly. Lord, help us to remember that when the time comes that our vision is not seen clear and seeing others the way you would have us see them, that we can pray to you and talk to others and read scripture, and you can help clear our vision. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right. I'm going to see if I can walk over there and turn that off while you tell our friends goodbye. Okay. You all right? Goodbye.